नमस्कार आई एम डी वेलकम्स यू इन डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग प्रोग्राम ऑफ ट्वेंटी एट जून सो वी आर नाउ विद टू हाईलाइट्स फर्स्ट इज द एक्टिव मानसून कंडीशन ओवर नॉर्थ वेस्ट सेंट्रल एंड वेस्ट पार्ट्स ऑफ द कंट्री डूरिंग नेक्स्ट थ्री डेज एंड सेकेंड पॉइंट आई हैव मैंशन यर दैट साउथ वेस्ट मानसून हैज फर्दर एडवांस इन सम मोर पार्ट्स ऑफ राजस्थान एंड लाइकली टू कवर इंटायर कंट्री इंक्लूडिंग सम मोर पार्ट्स ऑफ राजस्थान पंजाब एंड हरियाणा दैट इज रिमेनिंग पार्ट्स ऑफ राजस्थान पंजाब एंड हरियाणा ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट टू थ्री डेज सो विद दिस टू हाईलाइट्स वी विल प्रोसीड फर्दर सो यू कैन सी दैट हियर दिस इज द मानसून एडवांस मैप टूडे सो दीज आर वी आर हैविंग टू लाइन्स दिस लाइन इज फॉर यस्टरडेज लाइन एंड दिस लाइन इज फॉर टूडेज लाइन सो यू कैन सी दैट ओनली दिस पार्ट टूडे दिस पार्ट दैट इज सम मोर पार्ट्स ऑफ राजस्थान मानसून एज एडवांस एंड दिस वाइट पोर्सन इज रिमेनिंग and this portion is likely to cover during next 2 uh, 3 days so this is the accordingly we have mentioned here uh, same statement that southwest monsoon has further advanced in remaining parts of uh, north urban sea and some more parts of rajasthan and this is the northern limits of monsoon that is passes through this uh, uh, this uh, parts of pakistan that is the initial point that is 29.4 and 70.7 and then bikaner that is bikaner and then narnol or in ferozpur so this is today's nlm and this is the forecast for that is the same that south west monsoon will cover entire country in, including remaining parts of rajasthan haryana and punjab during the next 2 3 days so this is the highlights now uh this is uh, yesterday's realized weather you can see that uh, these two pockets mainly this central parts of the country including eastern parts of mp chatisgarh and this along the west coast these two zones were uh, heavy to very heavy and uh, isolated extremely heavy rainfall has been realized and other than otherwise you can see that over most parts of the country light to moderate rainfall especially this central parts of the country northwest and along the west coast this light to moderate rainfall uh, observed during past 24 hours now if we see a significant amount of rainfall you can see that eastern parts of mp this uh, 25 cm and 22 cm of the order of rainfall recorded in konkan and goa 20 cm and 19 cm rainfall recorded and so on in gujarat region you can see that 15 cm in madhya maharashtra 10 cm in odisha 8 cm in jharkhand this 8 cm of the rainfall reported during past 24 hours and if we see the eastern parts of uh, now uh, let us uh, proceed further and these are the synoptic systems prevailing today so this is yesterday's low pressure area now it is lies over north east mp that is madhya pradesh and adjoining areas and this east west trough runs from north west rajasthan across this uh, center of low pressure area to north east view of bengal and there is a western disturbance as a cyclone circulation in mid uh, troposphere levels uh, over jammu and kashmir and there is a offshore trough from maharashtra to kerala and there is a cyclone circulation in uh, lower and middle troposphere levels over southern parts of gujarat so these are the uh, prevailing synoptic systems and you can see the accordingly cloudiness this along the west coast including maharashtra and over the mumbai region also in south gujarat region there is a significant cloudiness and the another cloudiness seen in the central parts of the country including madhya pradesh vidarbha and parts of northwest rajasthan and uh, this uh, uh, haryana and adjoining delhi and uh, adjoining areas and third is the our uh, this uh, gangetic west bengal north odisha and uh, some isolated pockets over uh, this northeast india and over andaman nicobar and so these are the cloudiness and uh, so associated synoptic systems now accord associated uh, this uh, accordingly we have here mentioned five are uh, this diagrams uh, showing a uh, five days uh, weather warning if this map is dedicated for next 24 hours you can see that orange color is given to madhya pradesh and along the west coast including gujarat region konkan and goa and coastal karnataka where very heavy rainfall uh, in some pockets is uh, expected during 24 hours and uh, this second zone is the western himalayan region including himachal pradesh and uttarakhand where very heavy rainfall is expected and also this very heavy rainfall is expected over the sikkim region so this belt that is along the west coast including uh, gujarat region maharashtra and coastal karnataka central india that is mp madhya pradesh and also this himachal pradesh uttarakhand uh, here have very heavy to and uh, extremely heavy rainfall also expected otherwise this most parts of the country likely to experience thunderstorm activity and also heavy rainfall at isolated pockets including eastern parts of the country that is gangetic west bengal odisha jharkhand bihar and in central india this chatisgarh vidarbha in northwest india this rajasthan this haryana eastern parts of uttar pradesh also jammu and kashmir likely to experience heavy rainfall 
if we see the heavy rainfall possibility over other regions like kerala the south into karnataka and also the saurashtra coast like to experience heavy rainfall if we see the this map this is for uh, 29 valid that is 28 rainfall you can see this orange color is given to eastern parts of mp kokkan and goa and gujarat region and also uttarakhand where very heavy rainfall at uh, few places expected and uh, isolated heavy rainfall also likely over these uh, regions and also sikkim same situation is given for 29 now this is the 30th uh, valid for 30th june map you can see that orange color is given to eastern parts of mp and uh, gujarat region and konkan goa where where very heavy rainfall is expected otherwise this parts of northwest india including uh, this rajasthan region this uttarakhand uttar pradesh bihar and parts of north east that is arunachal pradesh assam meghalaya and in uh, this interior maharashtra that is madhya maharashtra and coastal karnataka where heavy rainfall is expected on 30th of june if you see the map of 1st july you can see that heavy rainfall is expected over uttarakhand that is uh, western parts of mp eastern parts of rajasthan gujarat region konkan and goa madhya maharashtra and coastal karnataka otherwise uh, uh, other than this northeast india also that is arunachal pradesh and assam meghalaya and sub valley and western and sikkim likely to experience heavy rainfall otherwise uh, no significant weather warning is issued for uh, remaining parts of the country however like to moderate rainfall likely over remaining parts of the country same situation is are likely to prevail on 2nd of july except this parts of northwest india that is rajasthan and uh, western parts of mp and uttarakhand where heavy rainfall is not expected however light like moderate rainfall is expected otherwise for, uh, over this western parts of the country and northeast india same situation likely to continue on 2nd of july accordingly we can summarize that during next 3 days this active monsoon condition likely to continue over this parts of northwest central and along the west coast that is western parts of the country during next 3 days and thereafter this light to moderate rainfall expected over as discussed over remaining parts of the country so this is all about today's uh, weather discussion and uh, we will again assemble tomorrow for the weather briefing namaskar jai hind